Hey, what's up, Aaron here. Hope you're doing well. If you're watching this video right now, you might be checking out this little gig economy app called ShareTown, right? And maybe you're wondering, can you really make money by becoming a rep of ShareTown? How does this work? Uh, how can you really make money? Is it legit or a big waste of time? Let's check it all out, right? Anytime if you wanna get my favorite way to earn $10,000 or more 100% from home every single month, go ahead and just click the link below and I'll share with you my favorite strategy. Now on this channel, I have reviewed literally hundreds and hundreds of different ways to make money online. Some of them are really good, some of them are so-so, a lot of them or a big waste of time. So let's check out ShareTown to find out what this gig economy app is really about and is this a good way to earn some extra money? We'll actually talk about how much you can potentially earn with ShareTown, okay? Now ShareTown, is basically a service that picks up and resells large items like furniture, treadmills, pizza ovens, right? And it helps regular people that have these items in their house to get rid of them. So just in case they, you know, bought a mattress and they don't really like it and they wanna, you know, get rid of it, how do they actually get it off their hands, okay? So this service has come in and basically what you can do is you can become a rep of ShareTown. And if you wanna become a rep, you just come to the top right here, click on become a rep and they've got all the information on this page and this is basically how it works, okay? So ShareTown basically streamlines uh, the returns for large items like furniture and fitness equipment from premium brands. Um, our reps acquire inventory by completing in-home pickups and then earn money when they resell the oversized items locally on platforms such as Facebook market Marketplace, OfferUp, eBay, and also on Craigslist, okay? So that's kind of how it works. So essentially, you become a rep of ShareTown. You're kind of starting a reselling business, right? Um, it's only available in you know your area because you have to drive there. Now, these are the important things that you have to understand, right? The, 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 the main ones are these two right here. You need a large vehicle if you wanna do this, okay? So you need either a truck, a cargo van, an SUV or a trailer where you can actually put a large couch um, you know, a treadmill, a large pizza oven, right? Into the back so that you can store it, right? So you gotta go to somebody's house, you have to pick it up, you have to store it, and then you have to bring it back to your place and then, um, you know, obviously take pictures of it and then upload it onto one of those, uh, you know, secondary marketplaces like Facebook Marketplace, Craigslist, eBay, or OfferUp, right? Another thing that you need is you need a helper. You need a partner to work with you on this, right? So if you're picking up a couch, you can't do it yourself, right? So you need to team up with a friend, a spouse, a family member to assist you on the pickups, that's really important. And then, you know, yes, you do need a little bit of storage space to store these items, all right? Um, and that's all you really need to start. The nice thing about this particular, um, you know, gig is that you don't need any upfront capital. That's a huge plus, okay? With a lot of flipping businesses, because this is essentially a flipping business, right? The big problem is that you need upfront capital. You wanna flip a house, you have to buy it first, right? You wanna flip sneakers, you have to buy the sneakers first. You wanna flip, um, I don't know, electronics, iPhones, you have to buy the iPhone first. Now with ShareTown, you don't need any flipping capital which is really cool, okay? So that's why I like this side hustle, right? Because essentially what they're doing is they're allowing you to just go there. They've got already a network of people, okay, that want to get rid of their items. So all you're doing is you're becoming a rep. You need obviously the basic stuff like a truck, a helper, and some storage space, right? And, and, and obviously good work ethic to do this, okay? Um, and then they basically give you the listings of people that need to have their furniture pick up, picked up and stuff like that, and you just go. Right, so that's what you're getting essentially. You're getting a network, it's really, really cool. So scalable, no upfront costs, set your own schedule, okay? Um, this is how it works, right? You receive a, a pickup, all right? So you get a notification of a pickup assignment, all right? You schedule it and then you go and basically pick it up. Um, you store, you refurbish the uh, items wherever it's convenient, you clean it up, you take some nice pictures, and then you resell it and then you get paid. Okay, now here's a big question. How do you make money on this? How much can you make, all right? And how much does Share Town charge? Because they're giving you essentially a network of people that want to get rid of their big items for you to go flip them. Okay, so it's essentially like this: you get paid directly when you make a sale of the item. Okay, now when you get when you when you make a sale of the item, let's just say it's on Craigslist, you might sell it to someone and they'll pay you cash. Okay, so let's say there's a couch. Um, and you resell it for 500 bucks or 400 bucks, right? What happens is you get to keep roughly about 50% and then you have to pay ShareTown at the end of every single week after you have successfully made a sale. 
If you haven't made a sale and it takes you a little bit longer to resell that item, you just store it for as long as you need in your place until you make the sale. And once you've made the sale, that's when you pay ShareTown. It's really, really cool. So until you've made the sale, you don't need to pay ShareTown that week, if that makes sense, right? Which means that there is really no downside. Okay, if something doesn't sell, you just re-upload it again, give it a fresh look, right? Maybe upload it uh, on another listing on Facebook Marketplace or eBay or OfferUp, and when somebody snaps it up, you, you collect that, uh, that sale and then you pay ShareTown basically roughly about 50%, all right? So on average, uh, for most items that you sell and you flip, you will earn roughly about $160 to $250 per flip that you get to keep, okay? The rest goes to ShareTown. So that's pretty cool. So Overall, how much do people generally make with ShareTown? Well, look, if you're if you're doing this, you know, you should definitely be doing this um, either part-time or full-time, okay? So either 10 to 20 hours a week minimum, right? And you can expect to earn anywhere from $2,000 to $4,000, right? There are a lot of reps that are earning that because um, basically it's consistent, um, you know, jobs that you get to go on. The important thing that you have to understand though, which is really, really key for this, is it really depends on where you live and you have to be based in the US. At the time of this re recording this video, ShareTown is only available in the United States, okay? And of course, it really depends on where you live in the United States because if you live in a very rural part of the US, then you might not get as many jobs. If you live in a more urban area or an area more, there are more people that need to get rid of their mattresses and and, you know their their couches and their benches and their pizza ovens and stuff like that big stuff right and their treadmills then you will have more jobs and it's gonna be easier for you to pick up jobs I hope that makes sense okay but overall still really really cool they do a, a they do do a background check okay just I, I thought I should mention that but aside from that I think it's a pretty darn cool little side hustle now is this going to require a little bit of elbow grease yes is it gonna require you to do some work yes because this is a physical side hustle right Unfortunately, it's not online. This is kind of like online and offline. The online part is you get the, you know, the um, people wanting to actually, um, you know, move their stuff. So your assignment comes online, right? But then everything else, well, you have to go pick it up, which is offline, and then you have to resell it online. So it's kind of like an online offline thing, which I think is still pretty cool. Um, you know, two to four thousand dollars a month, right? If you want to do this on the side, um, if you're really struggling to get that cash flow in, is a pretty cool side hustle to get started with and then you can upgrade later uh, and do something else all right so if you want to check out sharetown and you're based in the us sharetown.com i think this is a pretty cool one for the right person especially if you have a truck or a van or a trailer that you can use and you can get get a partner to help you on this particular journey all right i hope you enjoyed this review of sharetown if you're here watching this uh th this review though um you might be looking for a way to generate some additional income now if you haven't been on my channel before i've reviewed literally hundreds and hundreds of make money online strategies right i've seen the good and the, the bad and the ugly i've tested a lot of them i've in my own money I've reviewed hundreds of different strategies now out of all the good ones there's one that I use to quit my full-time job in 2019 I used it to actually five times my old corporate salary I work 100% from home I think this is great for anyone living anywhere in the world as long as you have an internet connection and you've never made a cent online you're a beginner I think this is a pretty cool way to change your life and generate more income if you want to check it out, I've got a free masterclass. Just click the link all the way at the bottom and I'll show you how I do that for free, okay? I hope you enjoyed this review of ShareTown and I will see you on another video review. Take care.